Hi, we're Green Hope and we're off to our next international trip. This time it's to Suriname. We are extremely honored to be invited by the President's Office and the Environment Ministry. We look forward to interacting with the youth and working with a beautiful country. Suriname is the only country on earth with 93% forest cover. It is one of the few remaining green paradises left on earth. We are extremely excited to go into the Amazon rainforest, engage with 900 plus youth, engage with the local communities and share best practices on how we can protect the environment. This trip has Green Hope members coming from Canada, Dubai and Oman. Here we come, Serena! After 28 hours of travel, we finally land in Paramaribo, the capital of Serena. We must change the adult mindset of the capability and potential of these children. It's heartwarming to see young people like you to take steps and make the world a better place for our kids and for us. Green Hope works on the mitigation of the climate change, the reduction of land degradation, future justice, the conservation of biodiversity, and the prevention of ecocide. We reach out to all sections of civil society, especially young people. Through our field projects, we provide ground level, hands on exposure to various environmental and social issues. Protect your forests. Don't use air as you can. Walk or cycle to school to stay healthy. Use public transport and do not smoke. Through our youth engagement workshops and conferences, we engaged over 2,000 Surinamese children and youth. Including the children at the orphanage. First, you start by keeping yourself clean, then your surroundings clean, and then your whole environment clean. We planted trees with the children of the Maroon tribe and His Excellency Ambassador Lakin. The Surinamese youth came up with solutions as to how to achieve a more sustainable future and this was put together into an outcome document which was read out by members of Green Hope Foundation and members of the National Youth Parliament of Suriname. We were honored to meet Her Excellency the Foreign Minister of Suriname. We also planted a green heart tree with Her Excellency Lalini Gopal, the Minister of Sport and Youth Affairs. Climate action! We were privileged to see the breathtaking biodiversity of Suriname. 
We planted mangroves along the Atlantic coastline. We conducted a beach cleanup where we collected 19 bags of trash. We spotted the Guyana dolphin in the Suriname River. We witnessed the hatching of a leatherback turtle. We visited a sloth sanctuary. Green Hope Foundation cemented its relationship with Suriname when we signed an official partnership with the National Youth Parliament of Suriname. Today is our last day here in Suriname and we can't believe that we had 10 days with such uh, wonderful experiences where we learned so much and we shared our best practices engaging with amazing people in this country and it, this would not have been possible without uh, His Excellency so that is really really awesome and we are we, we are really sad that we are leaving here today but we are very positive people so we are saying that we are leaving one home and we're just going to another home right now so we would just like to say so right now we're gonna board our flight to Amsterdam and then back to